Welcome back, everybody. <clears throat> so, um, I had I had recorded in a little bit further ahead uh, before I decided to commit to the California Compliant Challenge. However, um, thinking back on it, I should probably make sure that since I started basically in the last video uh, with this challenge, I, I thought I better go back and make sure that all my guns were California compliant moving forward um, and, and making any modifications that um, I need to in order to make it Cal California compliant. So, in our last video, um, here, let's, let's first check it out, guns. Okay, so, in our last video, uh, we picked up the 5.7 here. I think I called it a 7.5 from Fabrique Nationale, um, model 5.7. Um, let's see here. Now, California, California state law says that if you were to if you were to possess a handgun it must be on what's what's called the California handgun roster um so it's a it's a list of guns oh, oh, hands broken here come on sorry there you go it's a list of guns that um the state of California has stated that we we will allow you to have these guns here if it's not on the list it's your share of luck uh, the only exception being if the firearm was made before 1899, in which case it's an antique and therefore not subject to um, the California handgun roster. Um, first, here we have the. Uh, let's see, what is this? It just says 9mm Parabellum. Um, I believe that's a HK USP, Heckler and Cock USP. Oh, look. Um, it's got a threaded barrel and a detachable magazine. So that's actually technically, well, without the threaded barrel, it'd be California compliant. Um, but so right here, I'm going to go ahead and put right here. If the firearm is on the roster or not, the HK USP nine millimeter looks to be, uh, the FN five, seven again, looks to be. Um, the shotgun now is over capacity. Like I said, I was doing, you know, I only just decided to do a California compliant challenge. Uh, so that one, I'm going to have to reduce the capacity. Uh, the rifle here is, well, it's not a semi-automatic with a detachable magazine. Um, it's, it's a bolt action. Looks like a, um, Springfield 1903, but I mean, it shouldn't have it. It should, it should have, it should have a um, fixed magazine, not a detachable one, but um, the limit is 10. So, you know what? I'm going to, I'm going to reduce the capacity on that one just because it's a, um, I suppose I can keep it as such. And because it's detachable, I can keep it up to 10 rounds. Uh, but I'm I'm still going to reduce that to five, um, or at least to its base. Um, the shotgun, I'm not sure. You know, I'm not entirely sure, but it looks like maybe a Mossberg 500 or some such variant. Um, I'm not sure about what that rail though. But um, in any case, um, for hunting, I know you can have only three rounds. But for self-defense, I think you can do about five. Uh, now, the grenades, the grenades will have to go. I'm going to keep my flash grenades um, as, as a non-lethal alternative. Um, yeah. So, moving forward, if, if there's a handgun for sale, I have to double-check the roster. Um, and I'm going to put, according to... The I want to say it's the Giffords Law Center. I'm going to go ahead and put the rules, uh, the California laws here, for you to for you to take a look at.
Feel free to pause the video. Okay, and based off of that, based off of those rules there, um, is is basically what's going to define our uh, our our challenge here. All right. Oop, wrong button. There we go. Okay, so. Hey, bud. Looks like we got some shopping to do. Got a selection of good things. What are you selling? All right, so I guess ah, I I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, that's that's not going to be California compliant at all, like in the least bit. Rocket launcher, definitely not. Um, first aid spray. Okay, why well, do you have that? What are you buying? Okay. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and the Okay, that's capacity. Can't do that. And then, okay. Uh, so the five seven, according to this, ooh, that cost me a bit of change. Um, let's see, what can I sell? I could probably sell some things. So according according to the wiki, uh, the five the five seven here does less damage than the USP, but um. It does do piercing damage, um, which makes sense. The the five seven cartridge is has you know it. Yes, it it take for some reason this in, for gameplay purposes it takes the same ammo, the the federal ammo here, the not federal ammo, um, but you know that that's chambered in a whole different cartridge. Um, but it, it does have a higher muzzle velocity, more more um, power to it, so I can see why um, it they gave it the penetrating power. Um, let's see, talk. Uh, let's see. What are you selling? Okay. This I'm pretty sure. Ah, good. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so we got five seven. No, I have to re-equip. Glad well, I made that mistake now. Uh huh. Uh huh. Scissors. So now I have green and red just need the, I think a blue and then we're good to go okay um, all right There was some ammo. Anything in here? No. Someone here. Uh, 
135 rounds of pistol ammo. All right, that's good. You know, I think I got I think I got everything in here. To the swamp. I see what you did. Yeah, the other thing I forgot to mention is that in California, doing this, all right, ooh, that's illegal, so technically that I'd fail the challenge right there, but um, I suppose I could do iron sight aiming, but that's not how. It's not how the game mechanics were made, so. Okay, my guy. There you go. Man, I do not like being in waist deep water like this.
Should I use that? Yeah, I'll do this. Text shit like this, okay. And then I can put that there. What's this? <laughs> Sir. 
<laughs> oh shit. Funny enough, that's that's exactly how I lost all my guns. If any ATF agent is watching. Crazy boat, he answered. That part's new, though. That didn't happen. Okie doke. <laughs> Looks like I gotta do that. Do -ba -do -do -do. There's a bird nest here. Shoot, shoot. Shoot the bird nest. Get a shiny. that I need that I need that more than this well, I could have just done that but there we go plus one capacity. Okay. Let's do this. Actually, you know what? This has been going on for a minute. I'm going to save. Is there a guy in here? I feel like there's just something in here. There's some money. Tip. See the fish here? Remember the big bass in the last one? I don't want to shoot these fish because. And with that, I'll catch you guys next time. Check out the channels out here, videos down there. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.